old Swiss Confederacy, the Battle of Nuffles, was fought on 9 April 1388 between the Swiss canton of Glarus, supported by its allies of the old Swiss Confederation, and the Duchy of Austria, ruled by the House of Habsburg, it was a decisive victory for Glarus and led to its independence from Habsburg rule. The battle was the last of the, of the Swiss-Austrian conflicts that stretched through most of the 14th century. A few weeks after the Battle of Sempach on 9 July 1386, the Swiss Confederation captured the Habsburg village of Wiesen on the Wallen Sea. The following year, Glarus rose up against the Habsburgs and destroyed Berg Windeck. Then, on 11 March 1387, the Valley Council declared itself free of Habsburg control. In response, on the night of 21, 22 February 1388, an Austrian army attacked Wiesen and drove off the Swiss forces. In the beginning of April, two Austrian armies marched out to cut off Glarus from the rest of the Confederation. The main army, with about 5,000 men, marched toward Naffels under the command of Count Donat von Toggenberg and Knight Peter von Vorberg. A second column, with about 1,500 men under the command of Count Hans von Werdenberg, Sargans advanced through the Karanzeberg Pass. On 9 April 1388, the main Austrian army, under Toggenberg and Vorberg, attacked it and captured the fortifications Lisi around Neffels. The garrison, comprising about 400 troops from Glarus and a few dozen troops from both Schwiz and Uri, held out for a short time, but was forced to withdraw into the hills. As they retreated, the Austrian army spread out to plunder the villages and farms. The Glerners then emerged from the snow and fog to take the Austrians by surprise as they were preoccupied with looting. Following a brief battle, the disorganized Austrians broke and fled toward Wiesen, but the collapse of the bridge over the Mayag or Wieserlint dropped much of their army into the river where they drowned. Seeing the destruction of the main column, Wurdenberg Sargon's army retreated to the village of Beglingen, now in the municipality of Mollus. The Swiss had 54 men killed, who were buried at the parish church of Mollus. Habsburg losses are less well known, but are estimated to be between several hundred and 1,700 killed. On 29 November 1389, the abbot Bilgeri had about 180 bodies moved from the battlefield and buried at Ruti Abbey in the choir of the present Ruti Reformed Church. In 1389, a seven years peace was signed at Vienna leaving the Confederation in undisputed possession of all the territory it had acquired in the recent war. In the same year, the first Nafel Safata, a pilgrimage to the site of the battle, was held. This pilgrimage, which still occurs, happens on the first Thursday in April and is in memory of the battle. The pilgrimage played an important role in the creation of the unified canton of Glarus. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to please like and subscribe. If you have a topic you would like to suggest, leave a comment.